Hey guys, it's Brittany Bashan and we are going to jump straight into this video. This is a makeup video. Um, I guess you can say it might be a little bit of a holiday glam look. Um, but basically it's me putting on my makeup. I put, I put, I bought, um, I guess a ton of new things. Some of these products are old. Some of these were new releases. And I was like, you know what? I was so against putting makeup videos on my channel because I don't feel like I'm that good at it. But you know what? Hey, I'm going to bring y'all along for the ride, okay? Excuse me, my wig is, is pushed back off my head so I can make sure that I have along my hairline gone. So don't pay attention to my little real life uh, flyaways. Also, my wig is not glued down. I just, I really just pushed it back so I can make sure I can get it so if it fall off, and a lift up at some point during the video i already warned you that it's not sold down it's really just on my head okay so the first thing i did was moisturize my face with the dual action moisturizer by clean and clear i've been using this for a while now let me zoom in you guys you gotta be very up close and personal with me today which you can see all of my imperfections on my face um and it's a lot of them. I have a few little scars here. Um, I'm kind of discolored around my eyes, little dark circles, and I'm darker around my mouth, um, which makes it harder for me to find foundation. So um, I want to tell you guys the products that I actually recently bought and that were gifted to me by family because they love me. Okay, so I actually bought um, my first set of Juvia's Place palettes which I think I asked on Facebook like what were some good palettes and the one name that kept ringing was Juvia's Place, Juvia's Place. So for Black Friday, um, I actually caught their sale then and bought it. And a lot of this makeup you guys I actually bought on Black Friday and a lot of it's just coming in. So I have Juvia's Place, I have Beauty Bakery, um, I bought the Fenty, I know I'm so late, I bought the red uh, Stunner, Uncensored Stunner Lip Paint, I think that's what it's called. Um, I bought that and I bought the KKW um, Ultra Beans and Rose Snow and Copper, I think. I think that's what I bought. So I just have like a mix of stuff. So I'm just going to do my makeup with you guys today to let you see. So as you can see, without makeup, I've like a little child. I look 12 and I do not look my age, but I think that's a good thing. All right, so let's get started. Okay, guys, I went ahead and did my brows off camera because I'm just not that comfortable doing my brows on camera yet. So I had to go ahead and try to get them somewhat sister-ish because brows are sisters, not twins. So hopefully they look like they're in the same family. Um, <laughs> just praying they look like they're in the same family. I feel like I did one better than the other one, but you know, we just gonna roll with it, okay? So next thing I want to do is I'm actually going to prime my face with the Becca Evermatte. This is my go-to because I have very um, oily skin. And the most oily part of my face is actually my nose. LA Girl Pro Conceal in Orange to color correct around my mouth and if I can get it to squeeze out. Oh, uh, I don't know where it went to but I feel like it's everywhere all over the camera and everything. Um, they can try anything, we'll make it better together now. So the first thing I usually do is my eyes. Um, kudos to you girls who can just use concealer, concealer on your eyes because I am not that girl. <laughs> I have to use a primer. 
I'm going to go in first with the Urban Decay Primer Potion. Um, and then I'm actually gonna go back over on top of it with the NYX, and I'm just, I'm out of this. Like. <laughs> out like without priming my lids and I was looking like a fool because I didn't have a liquor eyeshadow left because the grease had like balled it up okay hey girl hey So, I have is the Saharan by Judy's Place, and then I have the Masquerade Mini. Um, I did not get the full size one just because, like I said, I don't wear a lot of eyeshadow, so it made no sense for me to get the full size one because I don't wear a lot of eyeshadow. And y'all want me to be completely honest, I just think I'm a makeup kid. So, this is pretty much all the eyeshadow I have now. I also bought the um, Sahara and Blush palette because, listen, the blushes was looking real good, y'all. I, um, oh, I forgot to mention, y'all, what, something I got, but I'm sure later, but I'm really excited about it, too. All right, so, let's see. What should I start with? Y'all, this is, like, really John Gillis when it comes to colors like I was so impressed with just like the color schemes and the colorway like just the brightness of it because being a dark skin girl we gotta find stuff that show up on our skin and everything don't do that everything don't show up all right so I am going to take my blending brush from Sedona Lace that I've had forever and I'm really just gonna start with brown to be honest with you so hmm, let's see Burkina from the mini masquerade and the masquerade palette and I'm just going to start with her <laughs> All of this I'm just using with your work promotions just because that's all I know how to do. <laughs> Y'all think I'm playing? I'm dead serious. And with a flat shader brush by Eco Tools. This is one I have had forever and two days. And I'm going to use my Urban Decay All Nighter. This was also new. This was a gift from my Aunt Geraldine and the Harris family. They know me so well. So I'm gonna use the um, All Nighter Spray, which is something I've been wanting. I don't know how they knew this, but hey, happy for it. Um, so that's why I told you some of this was gifted to me. And I think I'm gonna go in with Cinnabon. And I sprayed the brush and I'm just going to wet it with that, with the pigment. And I'm just gonna press that on top of my lid.
position. And see the colors. I was talking about this um, Starburst. I don't know if y'all seen the girl worthy with the trap stories. Y'all, this highlighter is like magic. Like, I swear, like the pigment is ridiculous. And you don't need but like a little to shimmer. Like, it's, it's just crazy. So I'm gonna add this on top of whatever I've done. Whatever this look is, we're gonna call um, probably. I'm actually semi liking it. Ask me again if I can recreate it. And I'm telling you, and I'm so scared of this stuff because when I, when I use it as a highlight, it is it's very pigmented. You're gonna put that in the center. Oh no, you wanna see me just really focusing on the lid part. Sorry for this one going off. My husband is actually cooking tonight. So it's just gonna make the gold pop a little more. I probably didn't even have to re-dip y'all, but I did. So excuse me. highlighter as well <clears throat> so how you guys been doing for the holiday season i feel like i haven't really I I haven't, um haven't really been able to film so i guess i give you guys a little you know background you guys hear me say like i'm a teacher by day so i'm out for christmas break so it gives me you know a little more opportunity to actually, you know, film and interact with you guys. Um, I don't get to do that often. <laughs> I don't, like, I really want to be more consistent with my channel, which y'all so hard. Like, I didn't realize, like, when I started my channel, you know, that it was gonna be this difficult to keep it up and just, you know, finding the time to, to do it and to also just have quality content for you guys is just a lot. So, but you know, I'm happy that somebody's watching my videos. You know, it might not, for me, it hasn't really just shown that much on my channel, but sometimes on my social media, like my followers can be very, very encouraging. So I'm gonna try to keep at it. So, but you guys should also just tell me, you know, what what specifically you wanna see. Like my wig videos did really good, um, the synthetic wigs, but you know, I feel like I started that and then realized like, dang, like I don't actually even wear synthetic wigs like this. So now I'm like fighting to find more wigs to review because it seems like that's what people really wanted to see. So, you know, I don't wanna get stuck in that category. So I just really wanna know like what else you guys, you know, wanna see. Okay, so next I'm gonna use my Fenty Beauty. This is my holy grail of foundations. Uh, I've been using it since, since it launched and I'm probably almost out. And I need another 450, but 450 stays out of stock. So when it comes in stock, I'm shaking it out. If it comes in stock, I'm gonna have to buy a few. So I actually use it, shake it, and then just, well, I just recently started doing it. Just gonna 
dust a little bit of that on top not much i actually have used um i've actually been using this um i like it it hasn't done anything spectacular um i still need to put it to the test to see um how it works out put them all on camera because I'm not that fleeky. I can't do that yet. Lashes I'm going to be using. These are um actually from a girl in Kentwood named La Justice Wesley. She is a makeup artist and um, she was selling these so I was like you know what support support. So I bought them. Um, I don't actually know the name of them but they giving me not full on wispy, but somewhat of a wispy feel. They're very, very dramatic. I think for sure I'm going to have to cut them because I have teeny tiny eyes and these might be too long for me. So I'm wrapping it up and getting ready to put on this um, Starburst, Starburst uh, by Worthy. Ultra beam on top of this. Um, just gonna put a little bit to show you guys the pigment of it. It's redonkulous as well. Actually, so I'm going to change and fix my hair a little bit and I'll be right back. I'm gonna use my um, Fenty Beauty um, Uncensored 
Stana Lip Paint. And we're gonna go for the go with this. Hopefully it matches, and if it doesn't, who oh will? very holiday I actually really like it surprise because it's a lot for me but it looks cute so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe to my channel um, in the new year going forward I hope and pray that you guys continue on this journey with me with more videos so I hope you guys have a Happy, happy, happy new year. And I'll see you guys in the new year.